We are looking for uh, colored liners on north of Impala. Okay, she's right that way. I work for like Kipia Pirta project. We are doing land conservation and livestock management, you know, that's all we are doing. Local people, they think just lions are enemies. In the past, a lion kills an animal. I mean, you can't stand there and, and wash. We used to kill them. We used to have so many lions. And I've seen a big decline of these animals. After some time, we realized that the best way we should go is through conservation so that we can have many tourists coming to Kenya. Our mission here on Impala Ranch is to look at how humans and wildlife can live together sustainably. Impala sits in the heart of Laikipia County, Kenya. It's both a working cattle ranch and a research center. When we started this work, nobody had ever really looked at the behavior of these large carnivores, where they are in conflict with people and being shot or trapped or poisoned as a consequence. You can certainly see where lions have been lying around here. We are currently looking quite specifically at what lions are eating. Among the lions' natural prey here in Lycipia is the grevy zebra, which has been pretty well shot to extinction everywhere except Lycipia and a few remnants a bit north of here in Kenya. There's a problem when you have one declining species eating another declining species. The recommendations have been get rid of the lions. We can't lose our grevy zebra. But there are no data to back that up. We want to see if lions are preferentially taking down grevy zebras. All right. I love this bit. Yeah. Yeah. Zooming in. We fitted a number of lion prides with GPS collars, which take a data point every hour through the night. Typically, a lion sitting still is either sound asleep or feeding on a kill. So we're able to look at the data in the morning, plot it on Google Earth, and go to that site, hoping to find some evidence of a kill. Yeah, but this looks like another cluster that we might want to go look at. Yeah. yeah. Once you get on the right. The turn that goes right off the middle of the earth. Yes. Huh. Yep. I think this is what we're looking for. Yeah. This, this is blood here. There are about less than 2,000 lions in Kenya, and Lake Kipa is a very important lion conservation area. I think this is warthog, the, the, the main. main. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes when we go out to visit these potential kill sites, we bump into these lions, and I take that opportunity also to identify them. There are about 230, 250 lions around here. Well, that took a while, but we got something. So Mark is going to stand on roof, and then he's going to show me the direction, the direction where the lions are. It's like more straight to you. We are also using the GPS color to make the management of lion and cattle very easy. This color sends information via satellite the computer, shows you where exactly the lions are. So if the bomber is nearby, you go there and you won't have to say, you know, lions are very close by. I had some lions that came into my property and uh, I got an email from Impala Research Center. I could get from the Google map and I could locate where lions were in my property. I think it's a positive thing because it's a preventive measure. You can see straight like you? Yeah. yeah cubs there. Three of them. We're seeing a lot fewer lions being shot these days than were 10, 15 years ago because people are taking better care of their cattle. They're less exposed to lion predation and as a consequence, lions aren't learning every new generation to eat cattle for a living. It's simply not on the menu anymore. <laughs> 